With Black Friday sales happening next week, should you wait to build your computer or buy the GPU or other component, or is the time actually now? There may be some surprising things you should know and do not be caught off guard because this year is going to be a little bit crazy. Remember to check out our video sponsor, CDK Deals. They're running their best deal of the year in November. Use my code CC20 for 35% off. And yes, those Windows 10 CD keys are also going to work on Windows 11. Hey guys, Tiago with Classical Technology here. Remember to smash that like button for YouTube and for yourself and for myself so that we all get lucky during Black Friday sales and get something that we really want at a much cheaper price. So today's video, we're going to cover one very basic thing. Should you build your computer or buy the component that you need now or wait until actual Black Friday happens, which is going to be next Friday. So it's going to be next week and there are going to be a lot of things you should know and some very important ones. So that way you don't get caught off guard. So let's first discuss what Black Friday is. You all know that's when sales typically will come. That's the day after Thanksgiving. It's called Black Friday because that's when typically retailers would have their ink go in the black or technically when they would start to become more profitable if it was a year that it was in the red or they lost money. So retailers targeted the day after Thanksgiving in order to be Black Friday. Now, typically in the past, it's been technically just that one day. But recently, during the last several years, it seems like they've expanded the Black Friday sort of, you know, shopping day into basically the entire month of November. I bet you've seen a lot of retailers that you frequent both online as well as in store. I bet you've seen them say that, you know, Black Friday deals have started already some of them will do daily deals and things like that but typically even with that the best deals certainly will still be found around the time that black friday comes now here are some very important things that you have to know if this was any other year i would tell you yes absolutely for most of your components you should wait until the actual black friday day unless you catch one of these daily deals or something like that so first here's the smart thing you should do so that way you try to get the best deals possible on the components that you need some retail are doing it already doing sort of like daily deals or having you know Black Friday be the entire month of November. If you know the component that you want, you can start looking now every single day. Look at the price. The only caveat to this is if you find a good price, you're going to have the question if you buy it now, is it really going to be much better uh, Black Friday at a different retailer? Remember, if you buy something now, some retailers will honor sort of the price that it is, you know, in a week or two. Some places won't, so you do have to check sort of with the, you know, the rules they have there. You could always take early advantage of these type of deals and then later you can try to get a price match or something like that so that's definitely a possibility now even in a year like this there's always a good chance and i've seen it before last year that as you get close to black friday certain things are just going to be priced considerably better for example uh, hard drives nvme drives ssds especially all the new generation stuff that's coming out they're going to want to sell these and generally that's where we see some of the best deals aside from pc peripherals and things like that you're going to see some of the best deals on these type of components so if you start to see good prices on hard drives and ssds and you really need them start to follow the pricing see how it changes from day to day that way you can sort of lock in the best possible deal that you can find now those are going to be easy as you get to other components like maybe the cpu since we recently had intel's alder lake released ryzen cpus did go on sale and we can expect this sale to probably continue towards black friday and you may actually find some better deals around cpus and motherboards and different bundles and things like that if you wait a little bit longer there haven't been too many crazy things popping up yet and while you shouldn't expect to see too many deals on intel's alder lake or some of those newer motherboards you may catch a couple um, even micro center discounted some of the cpus already you may see some more of those around black friday now the gpu is certainly going to be something that's been in question you know ever since the beginning of time it seems it's been a very very long time. Do not expect to find any good Black Friday deals on a GPU. My recommendation for a GPU is that if you really need one, look every single day. I've posted various videos on the, on the Best Buy, you know, drops and the Best Buy app and, you know, going in store, Micro Center, Newegg, Amazon. There are various different tactics and, you know, just keep an eye on different things that you should be able to find the GPU. It may not be the exact one you want at the exact price you want to pay, but if you really need a GPU for the end of the year, if you really keep your eye on the 
the ball every single day, you should be able to find one without too much of a problem. But once again, it's going to come down to that price that you're going to pay. But don't really expect to have any savings on GPUs as you get near Black Friday. That's just such a hot commodity that it's not going to be discounted probably forever as far as we can see. So keep that in mind. If you need a GPU, you should get it now. If you're buying a pre-built computer, it's going to be the same thing. If you find a GPU, that's the most important component inside that pre-built computer that you want then you should probably strike now because this is why I said it's not exactly like most other years. There is a huge chance that the component that you want may actually not be available. Chip shortages are very real and they're here to stay for the next year at least. So even if it's an NVMe drive or even a CPU that you really want and you see it start to sell and it may not be the optimal price or the cheapest it's going to be, but there's a chance if you wait too long to get that component or even that pre-built that may have the uh, component that you want you may actually miss out on it and it's going to be completely sold out now some people think that on black friday deals it's really just stuff that nobody wants to buy or it's discounted only a little bit and you can get the same price during the rest of the year that may be true for certain items but especially nvme drives and ssd drives i've noticed that really some of the best pricing will come around black friday some of the you know cheapest prices you can pay for even nice hard drives or ssd these stuff like four terabyte NVMEs often you're going to find them for the cheapest prices around now. Now, sometimes during, you know, Christmas and the holiday season, prices do tend to get better again as people, you know, are buying it for sort of the end of the year, but typically Black Friday sales definitely on some of those items are going to be, you know, the best that you're going to find. It doesn't have to be the exact day. Remember there's going to be Cyber Monday coming up a few days later as well. So, those can also sell out pretty quickly if it's a very high in demand and actually a good component that people want to buy at a good price. So if you take anything away from this video in today's discussion, that's basically going to be it. Have in mind the component that you want and be ready to strike and buy it when you actually see a cheaper and pretty good price. Because while sometimes you'll get a better price by waiting, you may not get the item at all because of all of the shortages and how fast things are selling out. That's going to apply to basically any component that's in pretty high demand or a good component at a better price. Typically it does apply in other years, but this year is especially worse for PC parts. And of course the GPU, just get one whenever you can actually find it. But if it's a component that you're not particularly after, you know, a specific component, maybe you just need a hard drive or an SSD drive, then you could probably take your chances because there will be something available for a cheaper price. It may not be that one item that maybe has better reviews or the one that you really want in your system. So keep that in mind. If price is really your ultimate goal, then probably waiting and, and really striking when the iron is hot is going to be your best bet. But if it's something that you do want a better price, but a little bit in demand item, you may need to strike a little bit sooner than Black Friday if you start to see them go on sales, as a lot of retailers will have these early sales, or you're going to end up not being able to get that item at all. And in terms of stock and availability, at least for now, everything seems to be fairly okay aside from the GPU. The GPUs are in stock in many places. You can find GPUs, even online retailers that ship worldwide or different parts of the country. The problem here is the very high inflated MSRP prices of these third-party AIBs. Very, very high pricing across the board between NVIDIA and AMD. So then you're going to have to ask yourself and extrapolate that question even further than Black Friday. Day. Should you buy a GPU now if it's something you know you're going to need this year? Or should you wait until maybe closer to Christmas and the end of the year? Or perhaps wait until next year? Here's the tricky part. It's very possible that we may start to see more GPUs available, at least from now until the end of this year, just because it's the holiday rush and they want to get more sales on their books. Very possible, like earlier this year in January, that we may see a really bad drought of GPUs again, especially if cryptocurrency mining continues to be profitable. It's had a little bit of a dip recently, but certainly it has gone up in the past from these type of dips and it hasn't really been that bad because it's been very profitable recently likely why a lot of these gpu prices are also very high it's definitely one of the contributing reasons not the main one but it definitely contributes to that issue so very possible that the beginning of next year you may see even less gpus meaning much higher prices so it's a little bit of a tricky question. As we know, the closer you get to next year, people are going to be expecting the new generation RTX 
7000, the new generation AMD, you know, 7000 series GPU. And then it starts to, you know, beg the question, should you really be paying over MSRP for something that's going to be, you know, a year and a half or almost two years old by the time you actually buy it if we go into next year? That's going to be a very valid question, but on the other end of the coin, you may not even be able to get one of the G new GPUs when they come out because they're going to be prohibitively expensive, most likely, as well as still not really available because as all the major CEOs have said, it's going to be another year with a lot of manufacturing and shortage problems like we've experienced this year. So... In conclusion, it's a little bit of a hit or miss if you buy early for Black Friday or you wait until the actual day of. If you find the deal that you want, you should go ahead and buy it, especially if you find the GPU or even the CPU that you want. But remember, if you wait too long, stuff may sell out and not come back into stock because of shortages, especially things that are going to have silicon and chips in them. You really do need to keep an eye on that because good deals may pop up. They may go very quickly. And in other years, you could wait and try to catch a better price. But this is going to be one of the key components of this year. If you need something, probably better to buy it when you actually see it. Otherwise, you can wait. I guess the closer we get to Black Friday, typically we will see better sales around then as well as Cyber Monday. So if you don't need something specific, it may pay off to wait a little bit longer. All right, guys, let me know your comments down below. Are you going to wait until Black Friday or are you trying to find some deals now before stuff actually gets sold out? I'm going to do another video, you know, next week as we get closer, trying to find what the best deals are. So remember to subscribe for those type of videos smash that like button and i'll see you guys on the next video